All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how I tape my foot, just in case you're having uh, some pain in your heel or the bottom of your foot. You only need two things. I just have regular athletic tape. You can see that. Uh, one of them I'm going to use whole, and the other one I'm going to cut and only use half at a time. So let's get started. This is going to take a little while. All right, first piece I want to put right across the bottom of my foot, so I'm going to kind of pre-measure that. And I want to go right, right along the middle of the ball of the foot. I don't want to go all the way up here, just right down the middle. You'll see that here in a second. And you kind of feel the knob on the outside of your last foot bone there. So I'm just going to bring that up to about right there. Then I'm going to cut this and then I'll take it off and resize it and make sure it's flat. Okay. So I have that anchored on the other side of my foot. I'm just going to make sure that's nice and smooth going across there. You can see I kind of cut the ball of my foot right in half. Nice and smooth. There you go. And then we're just going to try to protect this part of our foot. So that's step one. Now the second one is going to be the anchor strap for all of our little mini straps. I'm going to do the same thing right where that piece of tape is on this side. I'm going to take this long piece, I'm going to take it right around my heel. Not too tight, but not too loose. I don't want to pull too hard, but I want to make sure this is nice and smooth and run it right out to the end, right where that last piece stopped. I'm going to come around right like that, make sure, and then I'm going to smooth that tape out so that's nice, puts a lot of pressure right there. And some people put a band-aid back here, but I really... I've never really experienced any any issues with just the just the tape itself. Okay. All right. Now we're going to switch to the little pieces, and we're just going to build a network of support right here to keep this tendon from stretching out. So let me get this one started. Okay. And I'm going to start on the outside of my foot. So if you have your right foot, this would just be opposite. My left foot's the one that always hurts. So I'm going to just put that piece of tape right there keep it on the guard, keep it on this guard piece on the other side, and then I'm going to bring this around, and I'm going to pull it tight but not too tight, and make sure I'm stretching my foot out here, and I'm going to run this right to the ball of the fifth, right like that. Well, let me take it out a little bit further, hold on, right like that, and then I'm just going to cut that off right, right there. Again, if you have to smooth that down at all, make sure you smooth that down. Okay, now I'm going to overlap these about half the width of half the tape. Just keep putting them on there, bringing it around, and I'm just going to go about half the width and keep working my way across my foot. Smooth that out, and then just trim that right off. Just like that, and then I'm going to keep working. I'm going to keep working that. Same thing, going to come right. And then I'm going to come right. Usually about four or five of these, you should be across your foot. Four or five would be perfect. I'm probably going to do four today. And again, you could do a little bit more if you wanted to. Nice and tight around the back so you have support. I think I'm going to do one more. All right. You'd be surprised how much... And like this keeps flaring up on the other side here. You can, you'll just keep seeing me repeatedly kind of smoothing every out. And don't, don't worry about it. We're going to anchor this down so these can't come loose. So, All right, one more right there. Right up onto the ball of that big toe. Okay, keep that nice and smooth like that. And that's going to be our support so when our foot turns in, it won't, it won't tear right there because I know that's it tears right there and then you feel that pain in there every time you stretch this out in the morning. Okay, perfect. All right, now we're gonna go back to the big tape. And what we're gonna do is just create a cast across using the anchor straps and then that will pin all of our other taping down. So it's pretty much just like that first one. We're gonna put that, just another one right there. And don't worry if these creep a little bit on you and they get a little longer. Just like that. Smooth that out. And you can see the lines aren't perfect. I don't know if you can see that. And then I'll smooth that out on the other side. Now I just want to overlap these halfway all the way down my foot. 
about halfway and you want to make these nice and tight. You want to pull that across your foot and nice, makes it nice and smooth and nice and tight. And if you do this the first time and it's too tight, it's right, you can just take it apart and, and, and try again until you get it just right. All right, so I'm going to do another one. Pull that nice and tight across the bottom of your foot. Nice and tight. Boop. All right, like that. Nice and tight. Just like that. You could tear this with your hands, but I like I like it uh, to be nice and nice and straight, nice and tight. See the little fleshy part right there. I'm going to do one more, and I'm going to leave my heel exposed. I don't want anything on my heel. I'm going to do one more right here. I might even cheat down just a little further right there because I don't want that pinching because that's this will nice this will have a lot of support now there you go now I have all these frayed edges right here so I want to make sure I'm going to do one more piece across all of those to keep those down and then when I put my sock on this whole cast will stay still okay Smooth that out, smooth it on the other side. There we go. Nice and smooth right there. All right, you can see we got all those edges trapped. None of that cast could come up. All right, now there's one more thing that I like to do across the top of my foot. Okay, but you have to have your foot on the ground to do this, so. I'm going to move the camera and then I'll show you how to do that part, okay? All right, here's the cast from the top. And if you can see right there, you see how the tapes, because it's so thick where I put all those straps on the outside, you're just going to keep rubbing that down. And like I said, don't worry, once you get your sock on and your shoe, all this is really going to adhere together. Now, I like to put another one across the top to kind of, to kind of keep this from flaring off and loosen up my support on the bottom. But I'm telling you, you do not want tape right there because when you step down, man, that's going to really pull on your skin. So, a little trick I learned on the internet. I'm going to lay this down. Now, now that's the sticky side. See that? We want the sticky side up. And then we want to measure that gap right between there. Right between there. And this is a little tricky because you got to get this to sit there. Okay. Now, I want, I want to get another piece. This is tough to get it to sit there. Let me see if I can get it to sit there. Tough to let your fingers go. There we go. Tough to get it to sit there. Then I want another piece that's going to go around the side and partially under my foot. Doesn't have to be perfect. So I'm going to take, you know, that's going to go under my foot about that far. So I still got the sticky side. Ah! There we go. Get that out of there. Now I gotta try this again. Alright, so what I'm gonna do, I don't know, what you're gonna see this. I'm gonna take and put the two sticky sides together. Can you see this? Two sticky sides together as even as possible. Don't stretch it out, needle nice and loose. There we go. Okay, so now what I'm gonna do, make sure you got some pressure with your knee down on the floor. You want your foot to spread out a little bit. Now I have that nice little piece so that my foot will be able to move freely. And I'm just going to trap the ends of this tape, run that around nice and smooth, run that around nice and smooth, tighten up my cast. Okay, so now, so you can, I can get my finger under there, so as my foot moves, that'll move freely and not tear all the hair out of the top of my foot, because that's going to be uncomfortable during the day. Okay, from this point, what I definitely want to do is I want to get my sock on, I want to put my sock on. I just took my sock off my other foot because I left it upstairs. Very carefully get this sock on. And what this sock is going to do is help warm up that tape and then it's going to stick. Okay, I'm feeling for any loose edges, making sure it's smooth. And now I got my sock on. I'll just feel that cast, make sure everything's in place. And then my last piece of advice, keep that foot in a shoe when you're awake. If you're not laying down on the couch and you're walking around, Keep your, keep your foot in a shoe so you have maximum support. And I'm telling you, once you stand up, you're going to notice this right away, how it doesn't pull here. So this is going to give your foot a chance to, 
to relax and take some time off and heal while the tape does the job instead of instead of the ligament on the bottom of your foot. So if you have any questions, let me know.